Casey Neistat is an insanely great YouTuber whose channel has seen some of the most explosive growth on YouTube. However, that wasn't always the case. Before I started vlogging, I had a YouTube channel for five years. And in those five years, I had a whole bunch of huge viral hits. Movies that got like 15, 16 million views. <laughs> But my subscriber growth was anemic. The channel growth is anemic. Flat like that. Ryan G. Johnson. You see, having an understanding of the video equipment, the lighting, the ability to publish a daily vlog is simply not enough. There are hundreds of thousands of talented YouTubers who have published outstanding videos, yet they struggle to grow their channel. And this was the question that I asked myself. And furthermore, what was it that Casey did to really trigger tremendous growth on YouTube? And these are my findings. Our story begins on March 26, 2015. Casey Neistat publishes his first vlog. But it's not just a vlog. I'm starting a proper daily vlog. It's a proper daily vlog. Now to understand the idea of a proper daily vlog, we need to back up a bit. You see, for most of Casey's life, he's chased the idea of being a filmmaker. Go. When I was a kid, I wanted to be a filmmaker. And Casey's not just a thinker, he's a doer on a massive scale. And over the past 15, 20 years, he's made countless short movies and films, striving to obtain that vision that he once held in his head. The idea, the ideal of being a filmmaker. And to that end, Casey seldomly refers to what he creates as a video. I'm going to make a movie. Short movies. Something that felt a lot more like a movie every day. And thus, when it was time to begin daily vlogging, it wasn't daily vlogging. It was indeed a proper daily vlog. Yes, I'm starting a proper daily vlog. And that brings us to Casey's success secret number one. Movies and films honoring what's most important. Here's something very important. No one gives a sh** about your stupid time lapses, your stupid drone shots. Now the lesson to be learned has nothing to do with the drone footage or the time lapse. The lesson to be learned is that everything is dependent on the audience. And that you've got to deliver on the needs and wants of the audience and keep them watching. Case in point. I always found it kind of hard to watch nonstop shaky camera vlogs. Casey mentions that nonstop camera footage is hard to watch. So what does he do? He locks off, which definitely sounds like a filmmaker term. He locks off the shots, sticks the camera on the tripod, and that makes it easier for the audience to continue watching, to gain value from the video. And this results in a video that the audience deems more valuable, that the audience has an easier time watching. And when Casey began daily vlogging, his ideals were higher. He wasn't making just a vlog, it was inspired by his years of filmmaking. The demands of a movie or short film far surpass that of a video that can be easily uploaded to YouTube. And to that end, Casey honors the thing that keeps the audience watching. Story. Story. Story is king. Everything serves the king. All of this is just here to serve the story. A well-told story. Tiny little stories. Story is all that matters. Casey's success secret number two. Hook them and keep them watching. Hooking the viewers early and keeping them watching is priority number one. And perhaps this is why Neistat has done so incredibly well on YouTube. He understands that story is king. It's also the thing that keeps viewers watching, the very thing that YouTube has gone on record saying they reward. We reward engaging videos that keep viewers watching. How do you keep viewers watching? By hooking them early and telling a great story. Casey Neistat, not so much a YouTuber, but rather a master storyteller. And his canvas happens to be short films and movies. People go to the movies, people watch movies to be entertained by story. There's no way any big movie does well without a great story and a hook. Example, on Casey's very first vlog, he tells the story of deciding to daily vlog. Yes, I'm starting a proper daily vlog. 
And at this point, Casey really begins to do the daily vlog thing while mixing in short films, short movies that really allow him to hit a higher standard on YouTube. And that totally propels his channel forward. Life Explained in 27 Seconds. That's a great story captured on film and published to YouTube. And just like a movie director, before any footage is shot, Casey takes time to understand the story he wants to tell and he maps it out, scripting for the win. Now that doesn't mean you need to spend hours and hours on a script, a few bullet points will guide you forward. By the way, I believe this particular shot really captures Casey at the height of his YouTube success. I'll explain why as we course forward. Hey, by the way, if you're new here, I'm Brian, and if you wanna grow on YouTube, stake your claim, amplify your message by subscribing, click the bell notification, and you'll be on your way. Casey's success secret, number three, be so good they can't ignore you. Five years prior to daily vlogging, it took Casey Neistat five years to gain 500,000 YouTube subscribers. Then I started uploading daily. And in five months, I had 500,000 more subscribers. That's 1 million subscribers. Five years for the first 500,000, five months for the second 500,000. So going daily is the answer then? No, kind of, sort of. If you wanna grow on YouTube, you see before you start publishing often on YouTube, you've gotta be good and people have to like your video. You know that old saying, it's not what you know, but who you know? My favorite part of YouTube is that no one gives a shit who you know. They just care whether they like it or they don't. And this reminds me of one of my favorite quotes by Steve Martin, be so good, they can't ignore you. According to Neistat, the only thing that matters is if they like it. And this is the starting point. If nobody's digging your videos, then publishing every day won't help. However, if you strive to improve your videos, you'll go far. So that's the starting point here on YouTube. To be good, really good. And a quote that drives me is success will be found in your next video. So how can you find the success that Casey has? Well, number one, focus each video around just one topic. Number two, make sure to tell a great story around that topic, hook viewers early, and with each video you upload, strive to improve something technically, whether that's the edit, the audio, maybe the camera quality. Now at this point, we're several months into Casey's daily vlogging and things are about to get pretty exciting. Casey's success secret number four, forget viral videos, go daily. You see, when you have the ability to tell a great story and the quality that you bring to your videos, your short stories, you've really got things lined up to have the ability to publish videos that totally go viral. Totally. Thinking like a filmmaker allows you to drive more views. Bike Lanes by Casey Neistat, 20 plus million views. Make It Count, 27 million views. Do What You Can, 8.4 million YouTube views. A Love Story, eight years in the making. Love story. You see, Casey Neistat had published lots of videos before going daily that had resulted in millions of views. However, the secret to success on YouTube is not about views. Success on YouTube is not about subscribers. In order to grow on YouTube, you've gotta build, you've gotta create an active audience. It's very different. And in order to do that, you've gotta show up and you've gotta be accessible. You've gotta make it easy for people to click on and watch your video. And publishing once or twice a month is simply not enough. And that's about how often Casey Neistat was publishing prior to going daily. But when you have the ability to publish videos that viewers enjoy, that viewers deem valuable, and then you show up on a regular basis, like one video weekly or twice weekly, when you publish videos that viewers enjoy, your channel begins to gain momentum. What you published yesterday, the video that viewers enjoyed, liked, and subscribe to, well, those viewers are gonna be far more likely to notice your upcoming video 
if you publish it in a handful of days. Why? Because you're top of mind in viewers' eyes. Being first in a customer or viewer's mind. And of course, the more you publish and the more the audience follows and watches, the more quickly you'll grow a channel on YouTube. And in fact, at this point, Casey was experiencing some of the highest growth per month that his channel has ever seen. A few times, Casey has mentioned perfectionism and the pitfalls and dangers of perfectionism. But to be fair, I think it served him well. For years, he had strived to create something that he held in his mind, an ideal that he shot and strived for. When it was time to call it quits, when it was time to go daily, his abilities on a daily basis surpassed most YouTubers by a long shot. And now and then he would publish that amazing short film. He would take a bit more time, put in a bit more effort, and the results were tremendous. Casey's success secret number five, going daily is good, being topical is great. This is perhaps Casey Neistat's most powerful audience growth tactic. In fact, it's reflected often in the videos he publishes today. Casey piggybacks off what the audience is already interested in. Casey piggybacks off what the audience is already drawn to and watching. Remember Casey's success secret number one? honoring that which is most important. And if you want to grow a YouTube audience, well, the most important thing is just that. It's the viewing audience. And you want to make it easy for viewers to watch. And you can do that by tapping into the thing they're already drawn to. Remember this image? In the summer of 2016, Pokemon Go begins to draw national attention. It begins trending across YouTube. It's mentioned on the national news. And what does Casey do? And Casey publishes Pokemon Go in real life. 5.3 million views. And for me, this is Casey Neistat at his best. He marries story, film, culture. He taps into a trending topic and he pulls it all together in an incredible style. It is YouTube at its finest. And he continues to tap into that which captures the public's eye. And it makes sense, it's a lot easier to get someone to click and watch a video they're already interested in. Fidget spinners, you bet. Drones, all kinds of drones. From the most recently released drones to literally flying and dangling off a drone. And to tap into even more views, he dresses up in a Santa suit and publishes around the holidays. Brilliant. And Casey leverages public interest any chance he can. YouTube's in the news? Well, Casey has thoughts. School shooting? Casey to the rescue. Big blockbuster movie? Yep. If it's got public attention, Casey covers it. So incredibly smart and powerful when you've got a viewing audience, when you're at the top of the game. And Casey's success secret number five, leverage strategy and create something unique and different. My plans are post CNN, post Beam. It's been like three months now of ruminating and figuring out and thinking and planning. I got it. I haven't been this excited in a very, very long, I, I haven't been this excited since, I haven't been this excited since the first vlog I uploaded on March 26th, 2015, 16, something like that. All I see are bigger, scarier mountains that I will climb and stop at nothing to get to the top of. I think this clip captures it all. At the end of the day, Casey strives to create something unique and different, something that captures the imagination of us the viewers. If you want to grow a channel here on YouTube, if you want to drive more views and gain subscribers, well, stake your claim, amplify your message by subscribing. Click on the yellow B to the G icon below. You'll subscribe. I'll continue to share the strategies, the tactics that have allowed me to grow, and you'll feed a poodle. I got two and they're hungry. I'll see you next time. You dig?